A few minutes, the Royal Highness uh, Prince Lado of Romania is going to join us. Uh, there will be this very short ceremony. I'll say a, a couple of things about what, uh, in fact, made us come here. And then uh, there will be a short, very short awarding ceremony of the fourth Cantemir Prize. This is a prize we uh, established several years ago at the University of Oxford. We delivered it to uh, three times there, and we wanted to continue uh, this annual award. And from this year on, this will be granted here, awarded in uh, Parish Castle. And that's uh, a certain moment, and that's also the name of the, uh, of the recipient. Your Royal Highness, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we have gathered at Perish Castle on the occasion of uh, the first in a series, we hope, a long series of Royal Colloquia, this time devoted to Utopia and Revolution. We hope to do it every year from now on, and this is uh, taking place under the auspices of the Royal Family of Romania on the Royal Estate. Um, this is not the first time we, uh, we meet in similar circumstances even to discuss Utopia at uh, Perish Castle, so we, we shall continue for the years to come. Um, this is also, uh, we thought, a good opportunity to revive uh, the tradition that we have established in also that I, I said, uh, the Cantemir Prize. Now I wrote shortly in the introduction of the conference that these two uh, uh, princes, father and son, uh, were universal humanists uh, themselves with uh, Romanian roots, uh, spanning a huge territory, a number of languages, of cultures, of civilizations, and setting a kind of example of transnational, in fact, universal uh, humanism at the uh, beginning of the 18th century for a huge territory ranging from Constantinople to St. Petersburg to London and Paris going through Berlin. So we thought that this would be an appropriate symbol for what we would like to, uh, to honor uh, every year. Now this year, uh, the recipient of the fourth Cantemir uh, Award is Professor Moshe Idel uh, from the Hebrew University of Jerusalem. Uh, Professor Moshe Idel, our friend, uh, was born in Romania in January 1947. I avoid the, to mention the date, she, he knows why, because he's born on two uh, dates, actually, according to the records. So this is why I always say happy birthdays, uh, Moshe, not just happy birthday. He is a stellar figure in the field of uh, religious studies and of Jewish studies, and he has uh, um, covered the entire field of uh, uh, Jewish mysticism for decades. Um, and we want to celebrate in this uh, 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 personality, uh, once again, a universal uh, humanist with Romanian and Jewish roots. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Peresh Castle. And I uh, cannot even begin to tell you how uh, immensely proud and uh, full of hope I am that after a number of years of interrupting the activity of the um, Canterbury Institute in Oxford, today we um, have the strength and the vision, um, inspiration, I would say, to move the extraordinary series of conferences and colloquia we started about a decade ago from the Temple of Science and Education, which is Oxford University, to the uh, Temple of the Romanian Modern State, which is Pelish Castle. I think it's quite a good exchange and uh, it is also a more appropriate place 
uh, in order to emphasize how extraordinary it is for a culture such as Romanian culture to have had in the 17th century people like um, Dimitri Cantemir and uh, in the decades later um, his, uh, his son. I found the project very inspired and very profound, a very responsible one from the beginning. And uh, despite the fact that between 2013, which was our first participation uh, at Oxford University, and today, there are four years of gap, I only believe that this uh, gap was perhaps the um, necessary step that we needed to create a more um, um, longer-lasting uh, event this time, um, opening the doors of the Royal Estate of Sinai up for you and for uh, the next guests that will uh, honor us with their presence. This is not something that happens for the first time in this building. Um, for 150 years, as much as the modern Romanian state was shaped in the walls of this house, uh, it was also a place where the most extraordinary scholars we had in the country for 150 years gathered many times, sometimes asked by the kings of Romania to give their advice in political matters, sometimes asking them to contribute to the um, Romanian science and culture. The result is that if you have a chance to look at the newly published book about the story of this castle, you will find out what an amazing number of personalities, your predecessors, um, passed through this fantastic temple, which is actually a unique place in our history and uh, in, our, um, in our destiny. Uh, as Professor Antoni said, this is the fourth Cantemir Prize. Uh, I had the pleasure to, um, to give the first one to a very prominent and distinguished French scholar of Romanian origins. And then the second one and the third one followed, uh, awarding a group of people, um, two each time, who wrote remarkable books about the uh, fields of interest of the, of the Colloquia. And uh, it is for the first time, this fourth Cantemir Award, that goes to a scholar for a lifetime achievement. So, quite an appropriate gesture in such a wonderful place. So, thanking you very much for the generosity to, to respond to the invitation of uh, uh, Professor Antoki. I would like to invite Professor Hidel to receive his um, prize. of Moldavia, and that's a very important book of his, I was able to 
situate the founder of Hasidism in the Romanian part of the border rather than in the Ukrainian Polish part. And last but not least, the people don't know that uh, Kandemir was interested in the writings of a German quasi kabbalist named Van Helmont. And uh, he, in a way, interpreted something which is still not published, but there are some articles about it, including one very, very recent. So, in a way or another, he touched Kabbalah, Sabbaths, and Hasidis, which I hope when everything will be published in the slot of my lifetime, more material, more points of convergence will emerge. So, Thank you very much for the honor, and I hope to be invited sometime again here. So, so thank you very much again. Thank you very much, Your Highness. Thank you very much, Moshe.